The Computer Science and Engineering Department is equipped with excellent facilities for its students to work on cutting-edge technologies. The department has got eight fully air-conditioned laboratories functioning around the clock with seamless internet connectivity, both wired and wireless. The laboratories are equipped with state-of-the-art servers, workstations, and a total of 500-plus desktops. In addition to these, the department possesses a high-performance computing cluster and a storage area network of 30 terabytes. The Software Systems Laboratory, or the SSL, is the place where our undergraduate students equip themselves with skills and techniques in programming and data structures and fine-tune their talents in operating systems and compiler design. The Software Systems Laboratory was established in the year 2006 in order to cater the growing requirements of the undergraduate students. The facilities in this lab include 8 servers, 79 desktops, 2 Wi-Fi routers and printers. This lab has computing facility with wired and wireless internet connectivity. The Hardware and Embedded Systems Lab is another facility in the department that is involved with skill development in computer hardware. Systems Lab provides infrastructure for conducting regular logic design and hardware lab courses of second year BTEC students. The lab is equipped with digital trainer kits, power supply, oscilloscope, function generator, IC testers and desktop. The objective of the logic design lab course is to familiarize the students with the various aspects of designing and implementing logic circuits using different types of logic gates in digital trainer kit. In hardware lab course, we ensure that they are capable of writing assembly language program for different integer and floating point applications using NASM assembler. The Network Systems Lab, or the NSL for short, is the place where the students work on networks and database management systems. NS Lab is used for lab sessions, mainly for BTEC and MCS students. The lab is equipped with one Dell Blade server having the configuration of Intel E5 2.7 GHz processor, 8 GB into 8 DDR3 memory, 75 nodes with the Intel i5 as user terminals. The Machine Learning Laboratory was established in 2003 as part of a project funded by the MHRD with a view to promote research activities in areas like artificial intelligence, machine learning, natural language processing, and knowledge-based systems. The Secure Computing Lab provides the infrastructure for research in various aspects of security in computing. The Image Processing Lab is being utilized by the PhD and MTech students working in the area of image processing for carrying out their research and project work. These labs were established under the leadership of Dr. V.K. Govindan, Dr. S.D. Madhukumar, and Dr. K.A. Abdul Nasir. These laboratories are well equipped with advanced computer systems, high-end servers, and seamless wired and wireless internet connectivity. The Big Data and Biocomputing Laboratory was established with an objective of fostering research in the emerging area of big data and bioinformatics. The Biocomputing Research Group at our department is actively involved in innovative research in the areas of data and text mining in bioinformatics, computational drug repositioning, and systems biology. Equipped with an impressive 16-node high-performance computing cluster, this facility currently caters to the requirements of the research and graduate students working in the area. Our research group published a good number of research papers in reputed international journals such as BMC Bioinformatics and Elsevier Journal of Computers in Biology and Medicine. Other facilities in the department include state-of-the-art classrooms equipped with advanced audio-visual systems, an air-conditioned conference room named the APJ Abdul Kalam Conference Hall with video conferencing facility, a full-fledged seminar hall, discussion room, committee room, a department office with all modern amenities, a full-fledged edge server for supplementing the classroom teaching serves as a communication hub between the department's students and its faculty.